Good morning. Today's ABC for real estate is to pay attention to the retail that is either close to your rental properties or in areas where you're thinking about investing. The picture you see is a screenshot I took from Bloomberg Surveillance this morning. It shows the Standard and Poor Poor's Retail Index is the same today as it was in 1991. You can see where the massive run-up was going to the Lehman Brothers collapse, the reset of the uh, of all of the retail um, in the bottom in 2008 and then the in continual increase in retail over the last few years. But what you've seen now is the fast and continual collapse of brick and mortar stores as more and more people are shopping online. From my own experiences, I rarely go to the mall like I used to. My wife never goes to the mall. So it's a situation in which everything is more and more is getting ordered online. More and more people are accustomed with buying online. And all this does is create future pressure on all cities and community governments. The, the decline of retail is directly related to the two biggest impacts or two biggest opportunities for local governments to collect money, sales tax and property taxes. The, uh, the follow-up interview with Howard Davidowitz that was the precursor for this photo talks about the fact that there are at least 14 major retailers that probably will not survive through June of next year. If you are an investor and there is a large strip shopping center near your property, it's already very difficult for the small mom and pop operators to survive with the credit standards that banks have and the difficulty of getting financing. If the anchor tenant goes out, that center will go dark. You need to think in terms of how that will impact the value of your property. And more importantly, what will your city do to begin to collect taxes as these commercial centers fail? As a note, five years ago, just as a tangential piece of information, in South Korea, there were effectively no diapers ordered online by anybody. Now, 80% of all the diapers in South Korea are ordered online and delivered directly to someone's home. We're going to see that type of acceleration in a range of products in America. And as that phenomenon becomes no longer a phenomenon, but the course of doing business, look for the pressure to move from your city governments and your municipalities to the real estate investor, because the city certainly will not be needing less tax in the future. And the only way they're going to get it is from us. Become involved, understand what's going on, and be prepared as you move forward. So today, better pay attention to the retail. Thank you very much. Look forward to the next ABC on real estate.